So I'm here with Koshiro Shimada because Hello. a lot of fans wanted to know more about him. <laughs> so um, we thought we'd do a little fun interview today. Uh, so let's start with uh, yeah. how are you and uh, how, how is it here in Italy? How are you feeling? Well, I really love this town. Like I went to uh, old town in Bergamo and oh, I, nice. I got the feeling it's, it was very nice atmosphere in that city and yeah, yeah. it was wonderful. So uh, you did during this day you were here you could uh, yeah. see the city already. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Uh, yeah it was uh, happened on last night and yeah oh, nice. we just go to the restaurant and have a yeah, yeah good yeah dinner yeah. together with Stefan and yeah that's really nice yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, so Italy is famous for its food. What's your favorite Italian food? Well, of course pasta and pizza. <laughs> that's the most uh, yeah. favorite thing and. Yeah, I tried the uh, ones with the uh, meat with the uh, cheese, uh, sliced cheese on top. So it was also the uh, mm -hmm. some s traditional dishes mm -hmm. from Italy, from Bergamo. Mm -hmm. So I yeah. enjoyed it a lot. <laughs> Very good. So you've been living in Switzerland now for yeah. quite a while, five, six years, something like that. Yes. Um, so what's your favorite place in this beautiful country? Uh, because I've been not many places, but so it's hard to say exactly which yeah. places but i really love Lezan, uh, which Lezan? is very yeah. mm -hmm. high uh, also in the high mountain mm -hmm. and also champery of course and those and yeah. like, sometimes i want to feel some like city atmosphere yeah it's because the mount, like when i'm staying like all the time uh, in the mountain yeah. sometimes like too too small like, <laughs> it's like it's too, yeah so it's sometimes you need some more people some, around yeah, some more life sometime, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I would like to uh, visit uh, also Beve and Montreux because they have a nice lake. Oh, you have there. not been to Montreux? Well, like I've been yeah, there, yeah. but, uh, yeah, but, but uh, yeah, you like with the thing is like there. there yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree, I've been there, it's so beautiful. So beautiful Especially yeah. when the sunset, yeah, have yeah. you been there to the yeah, sunset? Yeah, so of course, and, um, yeah. and there was some Christmas market or like mm -hmm. something, like some events yeah. always there, so yeah. yeah, I've been once there. So. Very nice. Um, so, uh, did you ever like uh, in Chopri is favorite also for skiing and mountain biking and these activities? Did you ever try this or not yet? Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> Still dangerous. Yeah, like uh, because skiing. I want to take uh, some risk uh, yeah, during yeah. the off season. But I would try um, mountain bike, uh, mm -hmm. which is I'm riding behind Chris. Okay. So yeah, <laughs> I, so, yeah, yeah I enjoy yeah. the yeah very much. Because, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, this I always seen this in Champorino that this was dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, like it was only like like few times happening, but yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. but the, probably the more safe routes. Safer route, <laughs> yeah, 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 of course, yeah. <laughs> oh, what nice info about Chris! Like yeah. he's a mountain biker. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he is. Yeah, that's cool. Yes. Um, so you did a lot of cooking recently. Maybe you can tell a little bit of your last experimenting in the kitchen and maybe a fun cooking story. Well, like I'm still because I'm I love to watch like some athletes like yeah. how they like eat yeah. like and like I'm like I took some idea from them so I'm a lot of cooking with uh, some chickens and some well like I would say mm -hmm. broccoli or like something mm -hmm. good for your muscle mm -hmm. so, so yeah, yeah, yeah like I'm kind of more doing like not I'm not taking care of like tasting but rather uh, more, yeah rather, yeah. Yeah, like what is good for you as an oh, athlete. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but if you if you once uh, have a cheat day or something, what's your favorite cheat food? Mm, that's a good question. Like I'm I'm mostly cooking like some Japanese stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, but so it's that's a good, very good question. But also I love Chinese food, which mm -hmm. is uh, using the tofu and some mm -hmm. meat and mm -hmm. some spice there. Mm -hmm. uh, we call it this uh, marble tofu. Mm -hmm. So I love those kind of uh, spicy one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I agree. I love spicy food. So. That's good. <laughs> okay. Um, okay, so let's go a little bit to like, what's your favorite? What can you can recommend to the fans? Um, so, do you have a favorite TV show or movie that you like to recommend? Now I'm my I, I do have my boom now. Like uh, I'm watching a lot of like British Got Talent. Mm -hmm. or, like, oh, so yeah. I love to watch some great performance there. Mm -hmm. like, so some the magic, singing, singing, yeah. and yeah. magic show. It, the mm -hmm. good point is there. They are not doing only the sing like singing, so there's uh, some uh, very acro acrobatic performance and and uh, the, also the magic show, mm -hmm. which is so great. Like I really love to see that very like professional performance. Great. Um, 
Your teammate Dennis always talks a lot about books and that he loves reading. <laughs> Do you also read sometimes? And yes, I read some uh, Japanese novel book, uh, which is uh -huh. uh, sometimes it's a love story and sometimes yeah. it's like uh, some dramatic uh, yeah. story. I would love to because I really love to get some emotional from the other thing, so yeah. I love to watch uh, book that. Do you have any title that you can recommend for your uh, fans? Yes. Uh, it's it's actually a very famous uh, novel book which was uh, it's called Hankyu Densha. Mm -hmm. uh, it's story about like the people rides in Osaka's train, like mm -hmm. local train. Mm -hmm. They meet in there and like they start in some love story and there's mm -hmm. so many like story there and mm -hmm. like yeah. So and how is it called? You can say Japanese title. Yeah, no, it was the Hankyu. Ah yeah, Densha. okay, yeah, okay, yeah. I see. <laughs> okay, um, what's your favorite music? What you like to listen to? In your I would like to listen like. Uh, many classic uh, classical yeah, yeah classical uh, for my skating mm -hmm. and like I also love to uh, listen to some J-pop like, yeah. up tempo music during mm -hmm. my warm-up mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, great <laughs> um, so uh, if you could choose any skater in, from the past or from now if you have the choice with whom would you like to skate a duet like right. on the ice well my wish is to skate with Stefan and Dennis that's the uh, my one dream of actually, yeah. That should be possible. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I would like to, yeah, skate with them because yeah. they're such a nice skater. So yeah, yeah, I want to share that some great atmosphere yeah. of the team Champri. So yeah, I would like to join with them. <laughs> yeah, I really hope for that to happen. I think, and I mean, you have a lot of t you know each other very well. Yeah. So yeah, great. Um, if you look back uh, from all your performances uh, or your programs, what you're supposed to be very, what is your favorite program that you performed mm, close to your heart? I really have a good memory with uh, uh, Adios, mm -hmm. uh, which was my last year with junior. Yeah, junior, uh, with the red shirt. With the red shirt, yes, yeah. exactly. I love the program and it makes me a lot of like confidence mm -hmm. and like have some special energy. Mm -hmm. So I love that program, but every program that I I have I really love it because yeah. there's some special feeling that is always getting different. Yeah. Yeah. I now I I try the sing 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 which it, which was I mm -hmm. never tried that much like that's fast it's tempo, int yeah. intense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I really love that too. Like, mm -hmm. So I really ap appreciate that it's uh, working with uh, Jeffrey and also Stefan. Yeah, and I mean, you had a great start yeah, yeah. yesterday, yes. right? So maybe it will be your new confidence program. Yeah. I hope so. Um, so is there any other sport that you have never tried yet and would like to try? Well, maybe because not... it's too dangerous. <laughs> I've never tried the baseball yet. Like, okay. I yeah. tried like soccer and tennis and swimming, mm -hmm. hip hop dance or like yeah. some small gymnastic. Mm -hmm. I did a lot of sport like some yeah. movement stuff, mm -hmm. but uh, I'm not good to like throw it up all. Yeah. <laughs> so maybe like because yeah. my my trainer used to work with the baseball ah, okay. player, mm -hmm. so like I got some advice yeah, yeah, <laughs> so how to. <laughs> I play a similar game always with my students. It's oh, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Okay. Just thought of that. Um, you recently had your birthday. Oh, yes. How did you celebrate it? Like, well, happy birthday. Yeah, like, uh, it's because uh, before the competition, like, it was not, so not uh, yeah, we don't have yeah. so much time, but uh, Steph, uh, Steph invited me to, to have a dinner together, mm -hmm. and there was Angelo and Dennis. Yeah, and so Dennis. you had a little team champagne yeah, party. Yeah, team champagne party, like, uh, some small celebrations, so yeah. it was very fun. Fun, fun, and yeah, I so. I, yeah, I got uh, ready for this. <laughs> That's fun. Did you get a lasagna from him? From uh, this time was pasta this, because okay. I missed uh, uh, the biggest homemade pasta. Okay, so you uh, wished uh, to the have it, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I see. Yeah. Okay, let's finish this with a little bit of uh, this and that. So you have to choose between two things. And the first one is like we just talked about lasagna. I know you love it. So mm. if you have to choose lasagna or sushi. Oh, okay, I would say uh, that's so hard. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I'm not sorry. Yeah. <laughs> I will pick still sushi. Still sushi. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, beach or mountains? Uh, mountain. Yeah. <laughs> you live in the mountains. Yeah, you chose to live in the mountains. <laughs> um, 
as a difficult one. Would you rather be able to fly or read people's minds? Uh, I would like to choose uh, to fly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I, don't want, I don't want to read uh, the other person's mind. I think the same. It could be really weird, <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, like, yeah, there's yeah. a lot of information and it makes you feel a bit crazy. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I feel the same. Yeah. If you would have to choose between playing ice hockey or speed skating, what would you choose? Speed skating. <laughs> I mean, you're already really fast, I'm right? I'm a bit skinny, so oh, yeah. <laughs> I will go and fall. Yeah. yeah, that's true. Okay, and the last one. If you either have to grow your hair like the same length as Dennis, Dennis? or shave your head, what would you choose? I will... <laughs> okay, I will uh, pick a longer one. Okay. That's what I guess. <laughs> okay. Could you imagine growing your hair? No, I couldn't imagine. Like, okay. Yeah, like, I'm... I'm a bit afraid to cut it very short. And yeah. Thanks. I prefer longer. <laughs> okay, but not too long. Not too long. Yeah, yeah luckily you don't have to choose. Yeah. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. That was so much fun. And thank I'm you sure. Very much. Oh, maybe you can uh, end this with a little message to your fans. Uh, okay. And, yeah. And thanks for watching and thanks for supporting. Like, I really appreciate like all like very warm, helpful support every time uh, doing the competition, also not doing the competition. So I'm very uh, looking forward to uh, showing my performance to everyone so see you in the competition yes <laughs> thank you bye thank bye. you very much thank you